Hi guys, it's Wine Day here and today I'm going to talk to you about my monthly favourites. I asked some of you in a few videos back whether you wanted me to do some favourite videos and I got a positive response which I was actually quite surprised about so I thought I'd go ahead and do the video. Um, I don't want this to be like a 20 hour long video so I'm basically not going to go through every product like in depth. Favorite. Okay, firstly, this one's a little bit weird, okay, but it's actually the Andrex Washlets, and it looks like that, and basically, this is a new product from Andrex, I actually got sent this, weirdly enough, but it's, the reason why I like it is because... When I go out in public, I always take Johnson's baby wipes with me because, I don't know, I've just got this thing about using public toilets and their toilet roll and how many hands have touched that toilet roll and yeah, I know, I'm a little bit OCD, I know, but um, I really like this because it's by Andrex and it's basically like, it's basically like Johnson's baby wipes, but it's a smaller version which I like and it's obviously to, you know, avoid using tissue and plus I don't really like the idea of using a dry tissue to you know clean down there so um, I really like the idea of this and you know go Andrex like this is really cool I really like this so if you don't want to be lugging around the big massive baby Johnson's um, baby wipes around you can definitely go for the Andrex okay next is some body shop products you guys saw um, some of the products in a haul video and the first is this Spice Pumpkin um, shower gel which I absolutely adore, it smells divine, it's very spicy and considering I like really sweet type smells this is really really good it's quite moisturising as well and I like the fact that the consistency is quite thick because I don't know what's going on with like I don't know the shower gel industry but they're getting thinner and thinner and it's like water but I like the fact that this is thick and it really lathers up so that's that I'm not sure if they still sell this because it did come out in, in the Christmas collection and then I did buy it in, in the Boxing Day sale so I'm not too sure if they still have this. Next is this lip balm. Um, it's called the Satsuma Shimmer Clementine Skin Skintilanti. I so butchered that. But um, it smells like clementines which is quite weird because I like vanilla as you guys probably know I love vanilla things and vanilla smelling things or, or no scent at all but I'm really actually starting to like this and it's very moisturizing I normally use this before I go to bed at night because I like to go to bed with like you know moisturized lips and when I wake up in the morning they're still moisturized and they don't give that greasy feel either which I really like. I mean, I've just got a thing with going to bed with dry lips. I mean, you never know who you're kissing in your dream. Next one, Body Shop, is also from their Christmas collection. Sorry, guys. But it's their um, Cranberry Joy Body Scrub, which is gorgeous. It's really, like, it's really thick. And also the bits inside are really cool so they really you know get into your skin the one disadvantage though is that sometimes I feel like the bits don't always come off like they want to be your best friends and stick on your body all day every day but I use it about once a week um, there's only like a little bit left but I really do like it if you want to see what the consistency looks like it just looks like that and you can probably see all the little bits inside it too so it's not too thick and not too thin. Also from Body Shop as well is their Coco Mania Body Butter. Now this, I had to ask around and find out if you could actually eat this. This was gorgeous. I love the smell of this. Uh, it smells like a different type of cocoa. It's not like just chocolate. It's more like cocoa. And it's called Choco Mania. I think it should have been called Coco Mania or something because it really tastes like cocoa. Taste, see? All these food smelling products taste, you know. <laughs> so um, it's called the um, Coco Mania Body Butter 48 Feel Good Hydration. Now it's winter time, so for me to feel hydrated, it does take a lot. So it doesn't 100% moisturize my body but I do mix it in with like um, an aloe vera oil so I put an aloe vera oil on first and then I put this on and like the moisture is amazing I don't know I just think my skin likes oils because I don't know why this wouldn't work but 
in terms of like the consistency it's not too thin and it's not too thick either so I definitely enjoy using this and I think that's limited edition as well actually okay next on to some beauty products you guys have heard me talk about this product in so many of my tutorials and it's this black up blush I'm still loving it I've got it on today I don't know if you can see and it's just such a gorgeous blush looks like that especially for women of color like I cannot go on and on and on about this it's so gorgeous it's so natural just gives you that natural flush I mean I'll put some links to some of the tutorials below to just show you how amazing they are and the reason why I keep going on about this blush is because I have been looking for blushes that suit women of colour for a really long time and the fact that it's not orange, because you know women of colour are supposed to wear orange blush, so they say the fact that it's not orange but it still gives you that natural glow, I really like that for that next is my Illamasqua um, cream, what's it called? Cream pigment in hollow, which I use as a base. I adore this. You guys have seen me use this in tutorials. It's a really creamy texture. That's mine there. It lasts a long time. I know it is a little bit pricey, and Illamasqua is a bit pricey, but I've had this for like a year or coming up to a year, and it looks like I haven't even used it. Well, it looks like I've used it, but I, I don't use it that much. So that's that. I really, really like that. Next is a mascara. And this mascara is by Guerlain. And I'll tell you why I like this mascara. I'm a sucker for like tech stuff, like technological stuff and things that have like, you know, had a lot of thought going into it. And the reason why I like this mascara is because, one, it, it clips out and you obviously have to twist it but it's got like two mirrors in it which is gorgeous sorry to reflect you and the reason why I like it is because sometimes when you're doing your mascara you might have forgotten your I don't know mirror at home and just using your phone just doesn't work but just having it in your mascara is just amazing it does weigh a ton and it's so lengthening especially if you've got like short eyelashes I wore this I tried this out on two occasions and my sister asked me if I was wearing fake lashes and you guys know I don't know how to put fake lashes on so that was like oh my gosh I look like I'm wearing lashes hey <laughs> but I definitely would recommend trying out the girl and new mascara um, it's gorgeous definitely very lengthening I'll show you what the brush looks like this is what the brush looks like so it's quite you know lengthening looking and if you can see all the bristles, you, it really gets into your lashes if you've got really small lashes. So that's the mascara wand. They're two nail polishes and they're both by OPI and they're from the Nicki Minaj collection. The first one is this Barbie pink, which is called Pink Friday, which I love. Now if you guys remember when Nicki Minaj did a collection with MAC and she brought out a pink lipstick which personally I didn't find it was wearable but this I mean it is Barbie pink and quite girly as well but it's a really nice pink and it's from OPI and secondly from the Nicki Minaj collection is this colour called Save Me and it's just glitters I did have it on my nails but I took it off but wearing this alone is just nice because it just gives a bit of you know I don't know what that was but you know it gives you like something to your nails especially if you're like me and can't keep nail varnish on your nails two more products fragrances one is my Balenciaga Paris fragrance I adore this fragrance I think I mentioned this in a tag video when they asked me what was one of my favorite fragrances and it's definitely um, Balenciaga Paris oh it just makes me feel so elegant and so womanly it's gorgeous and lastly, speaking of womenly and gorgeous fragrances, is the new fragrance by Burberry. And I've wanted this for, okay, not for ages, but since Christmas. Christmas is when I saw it, you know, when you're Christmas shopping and that. Christmas is when I saw it and I fell in love with this fragrance. And it's called Burberry Body. It looks like that. The packaging is really elegant, really sleek, you know, with hints of gold. It's got the classic Burberry, um... The classic Burberry print in the top as well and I just feel like a woman mm. it's really it's a sweet but classic type fragrance I would say so 
If you're maybe going out in the day or going to dinner or you know you're looking very classy or going to a very a ball or some sort of something that will make you feel like a I'm a woman, look at me. That's what this fragrance does for me. So that's the end of my first favourite DVD video. So I hope you enjoyed it. Until then, remember the world is your oyster. See you all!